What's up everybody? This is MDP here to do another video and this video is going to be called Canva is going to be your best choice for a simple website especially for beginners and that's what this video is going to be about. I'm going to explain to you like if you need a website like a simple website Canva there, there is no better choice than Canva right now. Canva is going to be your best option especially if you're going to make the website yourself. Now, let me explain to you the most important reason why you should use Canva. Well, I shouldn't even say the most important reason, but one of the most important reasons you should use Canva to make your website is that if you're a Canva Pro user, you don't have to pay for web hosting. Now, if you know anything about websites, if you've ever dealt with websites before, you know that after you make your website, somebody has to host the website for you. And if you make your website using Canva, all you have to do is publish it and your website is online. I mean, and there's no gimmicks to it. Like uh, there's no watermarks. There's no Canva in your title. It's straight up. You make your website with Canva. If you're a pro user and they host it for you for free, I'm going to tell you, if you've ever had to deal with finding web hosting, finding web hosting can be just as difficult as making the website itself. So now that that's out of the way to free web hosting, this is the other reason why you really should think about using Canva. If you need a website, and I'm going to tell you, it can be really expensive to pay somebody to make your website for you. And then once they make it for you, you know, unless they got a way they can give you full control of it and you actually know how to understand the control of it, you're going to probably have to pay somebody monthly to maintain your website for you. So it can get really expensive, you know what I'm saying, real quick, if you get somebody to make the website for you. With Canva, you can make the website yourself. Now, I'm not going to use this video to tell you how to make the Canva website. If uh, this video right here gets a 1,000 views, then I'll make another video showing you step by step how to make your website in Canva. To be honest, most of y'all will probably figure out. If, you, if you've used Canva for other things, then you making it. You know, making a website ain't going to be that hard. It's going to be not that much different from making any other graphical design. And, uh, you know, just so you know, I'm not affiliated with Canva. I don't, I'm not getting paid by Canva to do this video. But I use Canva a lot. I'm a pro user, and I've been using Canva for a long time. I use Canva to make uh, my business cards. I use Canva to make my book cover. I use Canva for, to make all. Man, I have hundreds and hundreds of pictures on my social media that I've made using Canva. So in terms of graphical design needs, Canva is already the best thing going in my opinion anyway. And now that they've added the option to uh, make a website, you know, it just doesn't get any better. Because like I said, if you understand how to use Canva, I mean, you can make anything that your imagination will allow you to make. Um, I should start off by saying that I actually have made my own website using Canva that's being hosted by Canva. And my website is the universe is not excuse me. The universe is not what you think it is dot com. That's my website. I made it myself totally and uh using Canva. And basically all you really have to do, you know, I will tell you this much. You know, where you go into the search where you can bring up book covers, where uh uh, YouTube banners, uh, business cards. It's like a list. You could. It's all kind of different things you can choose from. But website should be there. If you don't see it, just type in website and it'll come up. And when you choose website, it'll take you to the template page. You have hundreds and hundreds of different templates you can use to make your website with Canva. Now, you don't have to use a template. I didn't use a template. I started with the white screen and built my website. Uh, straight from scratch and um you know like i said if you see my website you know i'm, I'm pretty proud of it it's a four-page website now one thing i you know i i want to tell y'all canva is not gonna work for a complex website that's not really what it's meant for it's meant for simple websites like maybe one to five pages but like if you if you get if you got a lot of pages or a lot of complex things going on Canva's not going to be your best choice in that case. You know, there are some 
drawbacks to using Canva. Canva's not perfect. You know, like uh, one thing is uh, like I couldn't figure out how to use any drop down in using Canva. Uh, another thing about Canva is that it's open source, meaning even if you make your design in Canva, somebody else can come right behind you and use the same design. And there's nothing you can do about it. So, you know, when you make your designs, make sure you make them complex enough the way it's going to be really hard for people to copy them. You know, um, that, that's, that's, you know, that, those are two of the drawbacks of using Canva. Um, you know, another thing is that the space is not infinite, meaning your web pages are only going to have so much space. So you're going to have to also make sure you manage your space wisely when making, you know, the various web pages. But uh, outside of that, like, uh, man, you can use Canva to make anything that you want. Like, um, I'm trying to sell a book. The universe is not what you think it is. .com. Greatest book ever written, by the way. But I had to make a website to promote my book, you know. And um, so, yeah, if you want to make a website to promote a book, promote parties, you know, small stuff. Canva is the best choice that you can make right now. I'm telling you, if you think people say that, um, I forget the one, uh, the, the, the website that's supposed to be so easy to use, man, it doesn't have nothing on Canva. Canva is so easy to use because all you have to do is find the elements you want to use. You can make the elements you want to use, you know, and all you have to do is align them and Canva helps you align everything perfectly. It helps you center everything perfectly. Every time you put an object on the page, there's lines there to make sure everything is centered. Like I said, anybody can make a website using Canva. It's really that simple if you have the imagination for it. And like I said, if this video is popular enough and gets enough views, I'll go ahead and make another video showing you step by step, you know, um, how to make a website with Canva. Um, now, one thing I do want to mention is that my website, if you check it out, is four pages, and all four pages come up at the same time, meaning if you go to the website, you're going to land on a home page, but you can scroll down through all four of my pages if you choose to, or you can use the navigation menu to navigate through the pages. To be honest, um, I didn't like Canva's uh, navigation menu, and they actually give you the option of whether you want to use their navigation menu or to use your own. If I were to use their navigation menu and hit the pages, it would have came up more like a traditional website. But their their um, navigation menu, the look of it just didn't fit with uh, with my website design. So I, I couldn't use it. I had to make my own navigation menu and us while well, all four pages come up. But I mean, I'm gonna tell you, man. In terms of like things like SEO, Canva makes it so easy for you. I mean, they make it the way you have to put the SEO in there to publish it. I mean, even um, I had bought my domain name from GoDaddy, and Canva even went to GoDaddy to configure it to bring my name over to Canva to bring my website, you know, my URL over to Canva. I mean, every single aspect that goes into making a website, Canva has it covered. I'm telling, man, like, this is my third website, by the way. The universe is not what you think it is, dot com, is the third website I, I've ever had. So I have a little experience in designing websites and a little experience looking for website hosting. And a lot of the things, like, say if you, like, a WordPress website is very difficult compared to, to Canva, making a website in Canva. Wix is the one I was thinking about. Even Wix now, to me, is not easy like it used to be. Now, Wix is just as difficult as WordPress, if you ask me. Um, it's going to be very, very hard if you don't know what you're doing to use either one of those platforms. Canva has a platform the way if you can use Canva for anything else, you'll be able to use Canva to make a website. That's how simple it is. As long as you understand websites and how they function you know you can make a website using canva like i said I, i've been dealing with websites for quite a while this wasn't my first one so i have some experience and i'm telling you i'm telling you canva the everything you need for a simple website let me reiterate 
a simple website is Dan Campbell. Anything that you need, everything that you need, like, um, yeah, everything that you need. And like I said, most importantly, you don't have to pay for hosting if you're a Canva Pro user. And you have so much leeway and so much, so many different designs you can create. I'm talking thousands and thousands of different elements and backgrounds and pictures. I mean, just, I mean, you have all kind of font choices and I mean, there's so many things you can do creatively with Canva, and it's not hard. It's as simple as searching the element, finding it, and placing it on the page. I mean, like I said, you look at my website. I created that website by myself. I did all of it on my own. Now, the thing you notice, I have proprietary pictures, so somebody couldn't use my proprietary pictures. But with that said, they could take all of the rest of the design, the design and use it. If they chose to and there wouldn't be anything i can do about it so you know just keep that in mind <laughs> using canva like i said i'm not i don't work for canva and i don't make i'm not making any money off of making this video and i don't have anything to hide from any of y'all so those are definitely some of the drawbacks you do have to think about when i using canva to make your website but like i said if you've never made a website before and you want to try your hand that there's no easier platform than Canva. There, there is nothing else that is this easy to use and can give you a product of very high quality. You can make a really, really pretty website using Canva once you start playing around with it. Um, I'm probably going to stop the video here. Um, like I said, if this video gets a thousand views, I will make another video showing you step by step how to make a Canva website, you know, how to manage the pages, how to do your URLs, all of that good stuff, you know, if this video hits a thousand views. So on that note, um, please like the video. Uh, if you have any comments or questions about what I covered in this video, by all means, uh, leave it in the comments. Uh, if you know anybody else or other people who may be thinking about making a website, but aren't sure what to do or don't even know where to I mean, I'm going to tell y'all, making a website can be a very, very daunting task. Very daunting. Just even trying to find somebody who can make it for you and then having to pay these people and then hope that they can make it for you exactly how you want it. And then after that, you got to go through all of this different hosting to figure out which host is going to be best for your website. Now, oh, one other th thing I want to mention. If you've ever dealt with cheap web hosting, and I have... <laughs> You know that you, you, a lot of the times th your website is not going to move, but so fast. It's not going to move, but so fast. One thing I will say about the Canva hosting is that it moves quite fast for it to be free hosting. And um, now the one thing I don't know about is security. You know, I know with my WordPress website, I had to do the security like every other day. I haven't. There is no security for Canva. So I'm not really sure how that works. Hopefully. My website won't get hacked, but uh, I've checked it. I've had it up for like maybe three or four weeks and it hasn't been hacked so far. So hopefully, you know, that'll be good now. Like, you know, that I, I, I'm hoping that their security is good because it's not really in the user's hands. So I'm guessing Canva takes care of all of that themselves. But anyway, um, like I said, once again, thank you for watching the video. Everybody, I love y'all. Peace.